Hi everyone, I'm Dr. Eleanor Toplinski. I am a board certified medical oncologist specializing in the treatment of breast cancer. And in light of Shannon Doherty's announcement that her cancer has spread to the bones, I wanted to talk a little bit about bone metastases from breast cancer and a few key things to know. Number one, for many women, bone metastases are the first site of metastatic disease from the breast but not for all, as we've seen here in Shannon Doherty's case, who previously has had metastatic disease to her brain. Number two, bone metastases from breast cancer are treated with breast cancer drugs. They're not treated with bone cancer drugs, again, because they started from the breast. Number three, bone metastases can be painful. In some cases, they can limit someone's mobility, impact quality of life. Now, again, we treat these with breast cancer drugs for the whole body because we also want to prevent or reduce the chance of metastases elsewhere or treat metastases elsewhere as well as in the bones. But in some cases, we will utilize radiation to treat a painful area or to stabilize an area that may be unstable. And rarely, surgery plays a role as well. Number four, in addition to breast cancer medications, we do add in bone strengthening drugs. So these are the medications Exceva or Zomeda, and these have many benefits. Some of the benefits of the bone strengthening drugs include they can help treat pain, they can help reduce the risk of fractures that can happen with bone metastases. They can lower calcium levels because sometimes people with bone metastases are at higher risk or develop high calcium in the blood. Sometimes they can reduce the need for surgery or for radiation um, to fix fractures or to treat pain. And as well as they can reduce the progression of bone metastases. I'm sure you have some questions and I would love to answer them, so leave them in the comments and I'll try to help.